What I have is FSHD, and the long-term name is fascio-scapular humeral dystrophy. It's a type of muscular dystrophy. Um, it's not one of the most aggressive forms, although I know it varies from person to person. Um, I've known that I had muscular dystrophy for 24 years. I knew for several years prior to that that something was wrong. But with mine, it's just been a slow progression. Um, I've gone to being a dairy farmer and farming and playing, playing sports and being, being a normal person. I like to do all that stuff. Um, and over the course of the years, it's taken me to where I'm in a wheelchair part of the time, more of the time, I guess. You know, I can walk some on even surfaces. So it's been a slow evolution, which to me seems like it makes it easier to deal with because you can adjust as you go. Obviously, some things are harder to do than others, but you just do what you can and you make, you make do, or I make do, I guess. I'll go down to KU, to the MDA clinic at KU uh, annually, once a year. You know, I, I try to help out with them as much as I can as far as research, you know, following the progression of it. The more they can learn about it, I think it gives them a better chance to do something to cure it. But, you know, being part of it, if whether it helps me, you know, obviously I hope for that. But if, if anything I can do to help them with research or to, to track what's happening to me, if it helps somebody else down the road, you know, that obviously that's probably the next best thing.